This is the echo effect in Audacity. It's free on my computers and also uh, Windows computers. Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make this echo effect. And we're going to go ahead and record uh, the audio first. So you hit the record button in Audacity. This is the echo effect in Audacity. It's free on my computers and also uh, Windows computers. So now I'm done with recording this audio. I'm going to go ahead and select it uh, for me to be able to apply the effect. You, let me play it back first to see how it sounds. This is the echo effect in Audacity. It's free on my computers and also uh, Windows computers. So this is my audio now. What I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and select the entire audio. So you can apply this to just parts of your audio, but I'm applying it to the entire audio. So you go to effect and click echo. Now you have two major uh, decisions to make here. You have delay time and you also have the decay factor. So the delay time is the amount of delay between the echoes. So it usually runs from one to, I think from zero to one, but it's the amount of time um, that you have in between the echoes. In other words, it's the length of each echo in seconds. So I experimented with this one and I found out that the best for this type of audio that you just had at the beginning of this clip is 0 0.5. So I'm going to put that at 0 0.5 and the decay factor is a number between zero and one where zero means no echo at all and one is exactly as loud as the original voice or as the original audio. So for this one I experimented and I found out that 0 0.1 was the best. All right so 0 0.5 is about half at the time and then uh, 0 0.1 is about one out of ten. So we're going to go ahead and apply the effect and play. This is the echo effect in Audacity. It's free on my computers and also uh, Windows computers. You can hear that sounds really smooth and it sounds really good for this effect. And now we're going to go ahead and just export it and make an audio MP3 audio clip out of it. And we can use it in anything that we want. Is it gameplay or anything that we want? So now to export it, I'm just going to uh, rename it here as Echo Effect. And I'm going to export it to my desktop as an MP3. I'm going to leave these other ones as they are and export it just the way it is. And now I'm going to go ahead and play it back for you guys to see how it sounds, to, to hear how it sounds. And hopefully it came out really good as an MP3. And just, uh, just like that, you'll create an Echo Effect for yourself in Audacity. All right, let's play it back and hear how it sounds. This is the echo effect in Audacity. It's free on my computers and also uh, Windows computers. So that sounds pretty good. And that's how you make an echo effect in Audacity. Thank you so much guys for watching and I hope to see you again in the next video. Bye-bye for now.